Was that you guys reached out to him then? Yeah, you know, well, I think it was mutual. You know, he's been around here a little bit more now, um, trying to figure out if he's going to keep going or not. 13 years is a long time as a safety in the NFL. So uh, I think he's trying to figure out what he's going to do. Uh, but it was, it was great having him out. He's, uh, he's a class act, great player. Any other cameos that we can expect to, during spring? I always keep some stuff in my back pocket. <laughs> <laughs> Seems like the defense really stepped up there right at the end of practice. And I thought they did. You know, I thought the offense really came out and did a nice job in the red zone today, uh, and I thought they needed it. You know, we had struggled a little bit in the red zone the first, two, you know, the first two days of emphasis. I thought they did a nice job today, and then at that last team period in the second and sixth competition, I thought our defense. After that first drive, the offense moved the ball pretty well. After that first drive, the defense really did a great job, and I was proud of them. You know, they were they were down a little bit and they battled back, they refocused, they did a great job. Safety were a position that was really beat up last year. They had to rotate a lot of guys in. From what you've seen, the guys that are healthy, what do you think of that unit? Well, I like what Nate Williams is doing. You know, I think he's studying. He's preparing really well. He's focused. Um, I think Jory Fogerson is still learning the position. You know, it's still new to him. He's still trying to figure it out. And so there's times when maybe he doesn't play as fast as he as he actually is. And uh, Victor just keeps coming along. You know, he keeps showing up. I think he's just getting healthy. Uh, and we're expecting good things out of him. So I think those three guys are really solid. Um, it's going to be good to get Jason Wells back there when he gets healthy. And it's going to be good to get, our, you know, our JC guy David Batts in here when he gets here as well to just kind of get some depth to that group. Jordan Polk seemed to be catching everything thrown his way, maybe one or two drops, but he had a good practice. Today. No, he did. You know, Jordan's really come on the last few practices. Uh, I think he's just getting more comfortable in the system. He's playing to his speed. He's not thinking as much and slowing himself down. He's playing fast. And uh, this was a day that allowed him to get featured some with some of the runs to the receivers and some of the catches that he had. So uh, I'm proud of Jordan. He's done a nice job about the last three, four days. When you got here and when you spoke with EJ, did you have, a, have, have any conversation with him about leadership and what that means? Um, well, we talked that as a team all the time. Nothing really specific with, with uh, EJ. It was, EJ was more of, let's just get back to doing things right. And from a daily basis, on and off the field, doing things right, being accountable. And uh, he's been great for us all the way.